beautiful home and uh, they have little gerbils. Hi, little gerbil. Keep playing. And tortoises, see, tortoise right there. And then there's one in there, but she's hiding. Good walk. It's so folly. Focus. Some other old church was the graveyard. Well, it's not some church. I think it's, I'm not really sure, but it's cool. That's what it is. Parish Church of St. Mary and All Saints. That. We're in the old town of the town that we're staying in and it's very cute. Very cute. I'm at the oldest pub bar in England and it's gorgeous. Like this is the room I'm in. There's it's huge and it's called the Royal Standard of England. And yeah, it's super cool. So Grace had a headache, so she didn't join me, so I'm dining alone, but I had to come here. So I'll try to show you as much as I can, but it's very cool. So we've been at the oldest bar in the world, oldest pub in England. What is happening? No, I don't like it. I just enjoy my meal and here's a cat. Okay. So I walked to the oldest bar in England, the Royal Standard of England on the main road. And now I'm walking back on what they call public footpaths, which basically just like trails through the woods. And some of them just go like straight through like crop fields and fields, lamb fields, which is interesting, interesting that a farmer would, I don't know how that works, but so yeah, so. I'm trekking my way back to the house so that Grace and I can start making Thanksgiving food. Happy Thanksgiving. So I strayed off the path and now I'm kind of lost, but it's cool. I'll figure it out. That's why you don't just walk randomly when you're in a place you don't really know that well, but I just couldn't help myself. So now I'm retracing my steps to figure it out. I'm so confused. <clears throat> I've walked the same track for like trail like three times now, but Sounds pretty, but I think I might be figuring it out. I, um, we'll see. I think I figured it out. I'm almost back to the main road and I don't know how to get back to the house. We're making Thanksgiving dinner in England. In England, because <laughs> our families are miles away. And our, cookers, miles away. our cookers are miles away, so we're attempting. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> Update, potatoes, double eggs, stuffing, yeah, pies in the fridge, oh, roll, masterpiece, yeah, pies are in the, pies are in the oven, yay, we got off on there at the, we got off the bus at the wrong spot. we're going to Windsor Castle, I thought it was the right stop, but because no. we're supposed to get out at McDonald's, and there's literally a McDonald's right there, so we thought it was a Uber. So now I have to wait for another bus. And hope that they let us get on with our other ticket. But. Because I'm dumb. But yeah, we're going to Windsor Castle, so that should be cool. <laughs> we made it. Finally.
Finally. <laughs> This is similar to what you go down and say like Cardiff. So. Perfect day to visit. There's an actual sunset tonight. We'll show you if you see it. Yeah, like La Hinge. Do you remember that sunset? Yeah. It's like Tom's the last good one that we've seen. Winds are so cute. Actually, no, of course. So, this is the called the Long Walk. Um, and look, the castle is right up there. The bus went past Beckinsfield and went to its end destination, so we had to stay on it longer than we thought and had to come back. I go there and like, back. Oh, like 45 minutes. Because the guy like forgot to stop in Beckinsfield, but then the Beckinsfield stop that literally just says Beckinsfield is not the stop that we got the on. The not the stop that we got on it. It's on the side of the freeway by a service area, so by a gas station. And that's where we dropped us off. So, um, so now, and we, we can't walk it. There's no nearest bus stop to walk walking distance. So we just have to wait for somebody to get us. So Starbucks is closed. Starbucks is closing. So now we got kicked out and we're waiting in the free 35 degrees. It's cold because Lars is on his way to come get us. What if he has an air conditioner? <laughs> that would be unhuman. <laughs> so yeah, it's, it's an it. Yeah. It's our last full day in England. We're done with the UK part of our trip. We have a ferry tomorrow at 10? 10 a.m. going to the Netherlands. Selfie. Selfie. So yeah, so we're officially, this is officially the end of our UK, oh Ireland wow. part of our trip. We're on to our last. On to Western Europe with our last boom. Well, that's like the only, yeah. <laughs> We, we saw six months, Ireland, but... We had to go to UK. Now we have to go to the mainland. But now we're going into the mainland, which is our last yeah. big... It's our like last, off. like, Traveling. transit... Or going Overseas, over the ocean. Yeah. But Maybe. we're so excited because it's so cool over there. So, so scary. And we're editing. We got something. So these clips are of uh, this little model village that's in Beckinsfield where we're staying. And yeah, so we didn't really say what it was, so that's yeah. why we're here. Yeah, so it's like this little like quarter acre piece of land. It's a little mud or something like this big. Super cool. So cool. So yeah, all the photos. I don't know if it's of Beaconsfield or if it's just. But I think it would Did be fun. Yeah. Huge. <laughs> Moving these bags for the first time in 10 days. How do you feel about that? I hate it, but it'll be fine. Grace. Back to this loveliness. We're in Harwich. Whoa. We're in Harwich where a ferry is tomorrow morning and we're walking to our hotel and it's freezing. It's dark and we've been on a lot of different trains and buses. We're ready for bed. Ew, ew, ew. I did not want to be in it. 